So actually in Chile we don't own our own water. Our water belongs to Spain. beautiful river. It's one of the most important rivers in Chile because it uh, gives the, the water to, to the capital. Santiago, seven million people. Maipo River is under a big threat, big, huge threat. This, this, um, this American company, NDC, they want to take our rivers, not only Maipo, the big, the three main rivers that feed Maipo, so three big valleys. Um, it's, this project is called uh, Proyecto Hidroeléctrico Alto Maipo, hydroelectrical project High Maipo. So at the first, in the first five years, 150 meters from the shore of the river to uh, uphill are going to get dry, uh, so all the plants are going to die, and in 10 years uh, all the Maipo Valley is going to get uh, dry. It's going to get like desert. So they take the water up river and they uh, give it back 100 kilometers down on the river. And they call this this company came to Maipo Valley uh, telling the people that this is an ecological project and it's a central de pasada. You know central de pasada is uh, the, when you take the water from the river and uh, give it back two kilometers below or three kilometers below you use the water generate electricity and put the water back three kilometers at the most so they come to this valley line saying that the people this is ecological project everything is under earth you're not going to see anything and it's a central de pasada i never seen a central de pasada that take the water from 100 kilometers from, from, from a river so they drive the river uh, where all the people live. This company is already here in Maipo Valley. They have, they have three places where they generate en en energy in the valley. But this project is the biggest of all. Y este río va a quedar eh, muy con muy poca agua. Entonces el 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 peligro que existe es que el, es que el es que el el valle se, se empieza a secar y las napas subterráneas que hay que que este río llena, nutre, todas esas napas subterráneas empiezan a bajar. Que el, valle, el peligro es que el valle se seque. The water system are very delicate and are totally connected on top and below the surface, you know. ¿Por qué es el río Maipo importante para la gente y el valle? Una, porque mantiene el cajón de Maipo verde, eh, totalmente lleno de árboles, o sea, le hidrata. A nosotros nos afecta directamente porque nosotros, el agua que nosotros bebemos se alimenta de napas subterráneas que vienen del río Maipo. Y en un nivel más bajo, esas napas no, se, no, no les llega agua. Por ende, vamos a tener menos, menos cantidad de agua y quizás nada de agua. Es porque Pinochet, el dictador, todo el everything to the foreign camp. El biggest problem that we have in Chile is that they sell the water rights to other countries so they want to for, for build this project they had to buy the the water rights from the Maipo to Spain so these two international companies are dealing with our water and there's no money in Chile so they, they all these reunions about these projects are being making in in Europe so they are just taking decisions of our resources not even in our country and all this energy that they want to produce with this uh, hydroelectric station they are going to send it to the north this uh, electricity is for minery we know 80 percent for minery is not even for the people so it's a private gold mine so the money is not gonna still stay in chile no so Actually, we don't, we don't need it, like Chile doesn't need this, this project. We've been trying to educate people in Santiago uh, with uh, talks and we just go there and we go to the center and we start to talk with the people, give like information. Where is the energy? 
verdad es que no sé, a la Santiago, acá mismo, no, no, no tengo, no estoy informado de eso. And we are here in Chile, very, very blind, the people destroying all the rivers, you know, cutting the forest. And... So we are against that we've been fighting for four years and we're going to continue fighting till we stop this craziness. So we you know we're going to go to those valleys and stop the machines and stop the cars and we're going to do whatever we need to do to stop them. To say here in Maipo Valley there is enough people with conscience that are going to fight this thing. Because uh, we want to break that rotten egg. So people in Chile realize how it's been all this process is done, be, been done. And, and if people awake in Chile on that, they're, they're going to Uh, unite with us and we are going to be not 200 or 500, we're going to be thousand like the students, you know, 10,000, 20,000, 30,000 saying no, we don't want this project. Chilenos, chilenas, we don't want this project, so go away. Go and do it in the bottom axe. <laughs>